I'm just your average college student. I'm in a difficult engineering program, which means I spend an unspeakably high portion of my day in my room, studying and doing homework. My grandpa was a very intelligent man who always pushed me really hard to follow in his footsteps as an engineer for NASA. The only company I have during those long hours in my room is my pet parakeet, Beaujolais. My grandpa named him after one of his old co-workers. Due to my strenuous workload, Beaujolais frequently hears me make use of my highly developed sailor's vocabulary. It's always amusing having friends over to my apartment, knowing my ticking time bomb of a bird could spout off a string of interesting swears any second. Every phrase he uses is an exact quote for me usually made during a moment of rage, stemming from the frustration of using WebAssign and Wiley Plus for most of my homework. He usually squawks to clear his throat before he says something, so... Earlier today, when my friends were over planning a beach trip, we all shut up and smiled when we heard Beaujolais preparing to hurl a funny line at us. But I don't think we've ever laughed as hard as last week when he complimented us instead with... You look so graceful. After we settled down, my friends asked me if I had any girls spend the night recently, which was unfortunately a negative. We just chalked it up to him hearing it a long time ago and randomly remembering it. Yesterday, when I was by myself, he delivered another weird line. This time it was something along the lines of, Soon, it will all be over. That one freaked me out a bit, because it was the second time in a row that it was something I had never said. Plus, it was a little creepier this time, too. Still, I had stuff to do, so I ignored it until earlier today when I was hit with a double line. Keep sleeping, my little lamb. Soon, it will all be over. This time, it sent a literal chill down my spine, and I got spooked and left the room. The sleeping part made me realize that somebody might have been breaking into my apartment and watching me sleep for the past few weeks. Unfortunately, the trip I mentioned earlier is tomorrow, so... I've just set up a hidden camera in my room to catch the intruder if they come back tonight. The camera feed can be viewed on my laptop, so I plan on running it all day tomorrow in the hotel room and sending it through a program that will send a notification to my phone if any change is detected. We'll be hiking in the middle of nowhere for half the day and well into the night, so I made it so that it will send me a text message. Since I believe most of the area we'll be at has SMS coverage, but no data coverage. Anyway, I have to finish packing for tomorrow now. I'll update you guys if I see anything.